Okay. Hello, everybody. My name is Luke MC. You're going to be playing on a Minecraft Survival playthrough. And this is something that uh, I actually already am pretty far in this world. But it was a world I started yesterday, and I actually did record stuff on it. Um, like, I recorded some video I wanted to be recorded here, but I goofed up. Didn't think to check that I have enough space in my files and in my file folder and stuff. And it only uh, recorded 8 minutes of it. It still said it was recording, but it didn't. So, I'm actually going to change the name to Leafs Playthrough. And... Yeah. Let me go on my phone on my bed, but yeah, I did end up getting diamonds and stuff, you know. We uh now I actually chose this preset to speed chose this seed. This is spawn. Now this seed is actually a specific seed that allows it to where the seed says zero. And I have a unique world to the seed, I dumped that over there, the ice. And uh, I don't know if you can see, uh, but there's also ice over there, so we are trying pretty well. And we've got a uh, double village, an acacia, and an oak village. Uh, my vision up there is the ice bottom, but somewhere over there. Can't remember exactly where, but it's over there. Uh, so let's start by, I guess, making a pickaxe. Um, boom. Uh, yeah. So once again, I'm very sorry. Uh, I think we might want to just tuck these away for a few minutes. We are going to actually want to go ahead and maybe get ourselves some torches. Because obviously we need torches. And I guess let's start by grabbing maybe some obsidian and stuff like enchantment table. Let me think. We also need to have another portal and stuff. So obviously we're going to need some obsidian. Now, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do for our base yet. I think we're definitely going to start, we're maybe not going to start that today, but we might get to that for this live stream. But I think we should start by focusing on what we're doing here. Now, since we have a mesa bottom, I you saw there was some building where I was actually working on bridging over there, so I kind of want to, I'm thinking we can build actually something in the mesa bottom. And when I say build, I kind of mean like just construct something nice and simple and basically it's gonna be based off of the idea well it's gonna be very much based off of you know a lot of the things that you're gonna find like it's ultimately based off of some big features that are currently available. Such as, well, well really, I don't know what I'm saying. I guess what I'm ultimately trying to say is I wanna build a place over there that since, you know, is based off of what you find nearby, which is a mesa volume. So obviously that would be a perfect place as a mining type deal where, you know, we can mine there and get the beautiful ores that it, plus that ha that's amazing for stuff like, you know, because it is literally a, you know, well, it's an abandoned mine chat. So, there's a bunch of abandoned mine chests over there, so there's obviously bound to be lots of good loot. Plus, it gives us access to stuff like terracotta, and that's an amazing building block. 
So it really is going to ultimately benefit our base. Well, it's going to benefit not just our base, but it's mostly going to benefit us. Like, it's just going to benefit us ourselves. And it's really a good thing. Because, you know, we need benefits. Okay. So we're doing this. Cool. I don't see a problem with this because I do have a shovel. I'm not going to do that lapis. Because I really need yeah. I need more diamonds and stuff for like uh, an axe and stuff like that. I'm live streaming. It's snowing. What? It is snowing. Oh, it's I can't see the snow, but it's our first snow, which is awesome because it rarely snows where we live. During the winter, uh, lately, due to deaths and global warming stuff, you know, like lots of global warming, but I'm not 100% sure. Well, whatever it is, we've been having, like, not much snow. It's been a while since I've gotten to sled. And it's awesome that snow and uh, my mom and, and y'all heard uh, and I'm sorry about that because a little bit disruptive but my mom came in to, to let us know it's snowing and that's pretty awesome because I'm glad that it's already snowing. I didn't think it would be early enough to be able to snow. I thought we would have to wait till around late Christmas. So, yeah. Now, I think I'm also uh, going to be later on live streaming other games. Um, I'm sorry I haven't been too active lately. I've been wanting and been trying to get more active on the channel. But, you know, I just haven't had any motivation to make videos. I'm hung up in family stuff, so I've honestly just had a lot to do that has ultimately affected my performance by a long shot. Block that off and start going this way. Now, today we're definitely going to be working on some of the bridging. Okay, maybe we wanna back up a little bit, like here. And then try digging here, I reckon this will work a lot better. Yeah, it should. I mean, to be honest, though, it already is. Well, just remember, I'm also looking for obsidian. And I, uh,. Well, I have a water bucket on me. One thing I could do is if I can find some lava somewhere. Well, I was thinking I could just get lava and just pour this on it. Well, no, what I was thinking was if I emptied this water bucket, I I was thinking about that I can empty the water bucket and just you know go in. I'm having trouble thinking what I was trying to say. <laughs> Which is kind of funny, but... Mm, it's just me. I mean, hey, I'll just rip this bad boy up. How do I have, like... No water dropping on me. This block is very awkward. Yeah, 
Dude, what's going on here? Okay. So far, I can probably say so good. So 14 is the number that I'm ultimately after. Really believe? Well, that's awkward. Maybe I should be a little smarter with my inventory management. This should be number 11. Yeah, 11. And this will be a safe 12, which is good. Yeah, 12. This should be a 13. I'm sorry y'all can hear that, but in the back of my brother's playing with his friends. So that makes this block. Yeah, it would have ended blocking if I stood on it, but it is safe now. And it should make a 14. 14, yes. So, I can return home. By returning home, I can prepare a nether portal to travel to the nether and begin what we need to do in the nether now, which is, you know, fortress, gathering resources and stuff, which means I am going to have to amp difficulty. So I'm going to need to be ready and have food. So obviously, I need to get food. And I think the best way to do that would be to, like, build a food farm. And an animal farm and all that. Uh, which might take a little bit of work, but it shouldn't be an issue. Now we got this rare structure here. And it's actually rare because it is a above ground. got the loot out of it, which uh, one of the big pieces of loot was this. Let 
Okay. I really don't care about... All I care about is as long as it's somewhat, you know, safe. So obviously I want to stay. Oh, we got lucky here, dudes. I can probably say we got super lucky. Because a warped forest actually has high rates in Enderman. Meaning to get Ender Pearls. Should not be a heavy dip. Should not be a hard task. And you know, we have access to this rare wood. 